Mr. Beast is the fifth full-length studio album by the Scottish post-rock group Mogwai. On an Island is the third solo album by Pink Floyd member David Gilmour. It was released in the UK on March 6, 2006, Gilmour's 60th birthday, and in the US the following day. It was his first solo album in 22 years since 1984's About Face and 12 years since 1994's Pink Floyd album The Division Bell. Monotheist is the sixth and final studio album by the Swiss heavy metal band Celtic Frost. The album was released in May 2006 and was the first new recording released by the band for 14 years. Blood Mountain is the third full-length studio album by American metal band Mastodon. The recording of the album finished in April 2006 and it was released on September 11th in the UK and September 12th, 2006 in North America. Living With War, released in 2006, is the Grammy and Juno Award-nominated 28th studio album by the Canadian musician Neil Young. The album's lyrics, titles, and conceptual style are highly critical of the policies of the George W. The Greatest is the seventh studio album by indie rock artist Chan Marshall aka Cat Power. It debuted at number 34 on the Billboard 200, her highest charting album at the time. The Memphis Rhythm Band includes Teeny Hodges, Steve Potts, Dave Smith, Rick Stiff, Doug Easley, Jim Spake, Scott Thompson and Susan Marshall. Both Sides of the Gun, is a Ben Harper album released in 2006. Split into two discs, the title suggests the two sides of Harper's musical nature. The first disc is made of mostly acoustic and string-driven songs hinted at on the last track of Harper's previous album Diamonds on the Inside. Street Elsewhere is the debut album by United States alternative rock soul duo Gnarls Barkley. It was released on April 24, 2006 in the UK, where it debuted at number one on the UK Albums Chart, and on May 9, 2006 in the United States, although it was available for purchase one week earlier as a digital download in the U. A Matter of Life and Death is the 14th studio album by British heavy metal band Iron Maiden, released on August 25, 2006 in Italy and Finland, and 28 August worldwide, excluding the US, Canada and Japan on 5 September. Broken Boy Soldiers is the debut album by American rock band The Raconteurs, released on May 15, 2006 in the United Kingdom and May 16, 2006 in the United States. The album was generally favored among critics and spawned the number one hit single study, As She Goes. Broken Boy Soldiers is the debut album by American rock band The Raconteurs, released on May 15, 2006 in the United Kingdom and May 16, 2006 in the United States. The album was generally favored among critics and spawned the number one hit single study, As She Goes. First Impressions of Earth is the third studio album by the American indie rock band The Strokes. It was released in January 2006, having been preceded by lead single Juice Box some weeks earlier. It is also the first album by The Strokes to have a parental advisory label. Everything All the Time is the debut album of Ender Rock Band Band of Horses and was released on March 21, 2006 on Sub Pop Records. It features new versions of five of the six songs from the band's tour EP some with different titles. In the Absence of Truth is the fourth full-length studio album by Los Angeles, California-based post-metal band Isis, released by Ibcac Recordings on October 31, 2006. Vinyl release was handled by Conspiracy Records. Avatar is an album by psychedelic indie rock band Comets on Fire. It was released August 8, 2006 on the label Sub Pop. UN Reverse is the sixth full-length album released by indie rock band Built to Spill. The Ben added one new member for this album, making Built to Spill a quartet for the first time. It was also the first album since Ultimate Alternative Waivers not recorded or produced by Phil Ack. Rebels, Rogue's Sworn Brothers is an album by punk, alt country band Lucero. It was released in 2006. The album features less country influence than any previous release. It was the band's last album for an independent label before signing with Universal Music Group in 2008. Amputer is the third studio album by American progressive rock band The Mars Volta, released on September 12, 2006 on Gold Standard Laboratories and Universal Records. 
Produced by guitarist and songwriter Omar Rodriguez Lopez, the album marks the final appearance of drummer John Theodore, and is the first studio album to feature guitarist and sound manipulator Paul Hinoyos, formerly of At The Drive-In and Sparta. Return to Cookie Mountain is the second studio album by American Altrock Group TV on the radio. It was released July 6, 2006 worldwide by 4AD, and issued in the US and Canada on September 12, 2006 by Interscope Records and Touch and Go Recordings. Stadium Arcadium is the ninth studio album by American rock band Red Hot Chili Peppers. The album was released on May 9, 2006, on Warner Brothers Records. The album produced five singles, Donnie California, Tell Me Baby, Snow, Desecration Smile, and Hump the Bump along with the first ever fan-made music video for the song, Charlie. Modern Times is the 32nd studio album by American singer-songwriter Bob Dylan, released on August 29, 2006 by Columbia Records. The album was Dylan's third straight to be met with nearly universal praise from fans and critics. We Shall Overcome, The Seeger Sessions. American Land Edition, is the 2006 album by Bruce Springsteen, 10 Silver Drops is the second full-length album by the American rock band The Secret Machines. It was released exclusively through the iTunes Music Store on February 28, 2006, while the street date for the CD was April 25, 2006. Boys and Girls in America is the third studio album by The Hold Steady. Released on October 3, 2006 by Vagrant Records. On August 18, 2006, first single Chips Ahoy was released as a free download from music site Pitchfork Media.